Thank you very much, Nicola. Hello, good afternoon to you. Well, we've entered the quieter part of the week, but it's not pin drop silence. These are the effects of high pressure from this morning. A lot of sunshine around and dry weather, but the cloud has been building in one or two spots, and that's because the high pressure isn't quite as strong as we had hoped. So we are still prone to a few thundery showers breaking out through this afternoon and through the rest of the week, although it is going to be fairly dry for most of the time, even into the weekend. Uh, so this is what we have. A lot of uh, frontal systems circling us. It's this particular warm sector that's moving up from the southwest uh, by the end of Friday into the start of Saturday that's going to give us some showery outbreaks of rain, just clipping parts of the south. But through this afternoon, as the uh, temperatures rise and we're seeing highs of 23 Celsius, we'll probably see a few showers being triggered off, particularly so through central and western parts of the region. The best of the sunshine staying out to the east, and that's where we see the highest temperatures. And then through tonight, those showers will gradually fade away, leaving most parts dry with clear spells. Again, some mist and fog patches into the morning tomorrow with lows of 11 to 13 Celsius and then we do it all over again tomorrow. I think the most likely spots for showers tomorrow will be in the west but more in the way of cloud too.